Hey everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for joining me on my latest Fortnite beginner tutorial video that will show you how you can use the objective device in your levels and what's the whole purpose behind it that you can then apply the same concept in your games. So right now I'm going to show you the same objective device and then we're going to apply it to create a win condition inside of my level. As you can see, I already have it selected here, but you can find it under devices and simply search for objective. And here it is, you have several options, but this one is the one you're looking for. As you can see, it's called a destructible object for use as a game objective. I already have a selected one. I'm going to deploy it now here. And as you can see, it's open to customization of course and it has a marker the same marker is present on the map but of course you can change that as well so let's enter the same objective and we'll go to the in basic options you have several elements here but we're going to go directly into all options as you can see you can change mesh there are different options that you can kind of apply and have instead of the initial device mesh mesh device you can set it vulnerability you can set it to health only thing now this is important because i'm team one it's already seeing it as a objective at my team so i won't be able to destroy it so i'm going to set it to none so imagine if you're having a level where you want any team member or team which destroys the same device is automatically the winner you will want to set it to none you have an explosion option if you want to have explosions the blast radius uh, distance you have your beacon which allows to kind of give an additional element of visibility friendly badge visibility within distance you can turn it off say save it to hidden hostile badge visibility again show badge on damage badge height Clamp to screen, show objective in HUD, you can set that to on, and different options as you can see here, we're not going to enter into all of them, because you now have the option of scores, we're just going to keep it simple as it is now, of course you have functions as well here, a lot of these can be related like reset health if you want to kind of block the other team from destroying something with an ability to kind of give it additional health and so forth and on destroy and damage as events that it can send out to other devices now i have it set up here but the last thing i want to do is to add the win condition inside of my island settings you can find that under round and you have here objectives to end causes the round to end when a player or team has completed a specific number of objectives if you set this to one it's already linked to this device so in theory when i start the game i destroy this device it will send a signal to the island setting which will then end the round and declare victory so let's try it out i have a gun in this box in this chest i'm going to get it and then use it to destroy this objective so we're going to start the game Here we are, here is the objective. I'm going to get the gun. I'm going to now destroy it with a single shot. And there it is, I win. And that's basically it. The objective is completed. You have the ability now to change a lot of stuff, of course, related to your needs and wants. But for now, in this, type of scenario the game is complete through this interlocking of objective device and objectives in the round on island settings there you have it it's a short and sweet hopefully video that will explain how you use objective devices hopefully you found it useful if you did consider supporting me through a range of means you can buy my books on amazon you can become my patron supporter on patreon and you can cheapest and easiest options aside of these options there is the cheapest and easiest option, which is simply to subscribe to my channel and be here for my new videos. 
That's all for me, my name is Ivica, thanks again for watching, have loads of fun in your Fortnite Creative Islands, and I'll see you in my next video. Until then, bye bye.